Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Have you ever been watching a really cool video and you see a really neat button just above their video and you click it and it takes you back to their channel? Well, I'm gonna teach you how to make that button. Unfortunately, you have to be a partner with YouTube to get that function. All right, so let's get to it. So here's the, uh, the button that I created for my videos. This shows up on every single video uh, that people watch. So what we can do is if we click that, it'll take us to our channel. Let's click this video hey, off. Uh, so this is the button that, this is where we're going to be putting the button into our channel. So this is the branding options. We'll click branding. Uh, and there's three tabs under branding. This is the one we're looking for, which is video page branding. And here's the information right here, 25 pixels by 100, a maximum of 170 pixels. Uh, the width can be flexible, but no more than 170 pixels wide. So that's the information we need to start with. Uh, let's go over to Photoshop. So we're here in Photoshop, we're gonna click on File, New. This is a new document, our width is already in there. Our 25 watt high is in there and our 72 resolution RGB needs to be or sorry color mode needs to be RGB click OK this is obviously way too small to work in even when I zoom into it it just doesn't work very well so I'll just go to image size go to percent make sure that constrained proportions is on so it does the percentage in both axes uh, let's go up 500% uh, there we go. Uh, so we're going to start off with our text tool. We're going to type in, make sure we're on black. We're going to type in KBD Productions TV. What a great name. Uh, okay, we're going to go to Edit, Transform, Scale, grab an edge, drag it up, double click, and it's set. Now we can, um, let's change that font. I think I want to do the same font I used in the first one that I did. There we go. Yeah, that font was called 321 Impact. So that's that. Uh, let's make it a bit bigger. So again, I'll go to Edit, Transform, Scale, Grab an Edge, stretch it right out to our full chunk of real estate we've got double click it when you're finished click on layers click beside the word in this little area or double click there it opens up this layer style make sure your previews selected uh, we're going to do a gradient overlay so click gradient click on the gradient here let's click that say okay you can change those up if you want. Let's click a stroke. Uh, let's click a drop shadow. And let's make that drop shadow a little bit bigger. Not as much opacity, so it's nice and dark and sticks out. There you go. So let's use that one. Uh, now we want to just move that down a bit because there's some stuff at the top here, it looks like. Now, before we, let's do a save. We'll call it Banner. We'll save it to our desktop for now. Make sure it saves as a Photoshop document so you can go in and change it later if you want to, if you want to update it. Um, now, when we export it, we have to drop it back down to the 720, so pixels. We want to do, sorry, 170 pixels, and then say OK. And that's our size that we have to put into YouTube. Uh, click File, Save As, make sure you save it as a PNG, you can't see it, it's down below, actually I could make that smaller. So PNG is right there, uh, Banner, just save it to my desktop, OK. So let's come back to YouTube, let's delete the old one, choose banner, PNG,
save there you go and there's your new button that will represent your channel again you can put pictures in there just text some people put a big arrow pointing basically to the subscribe button again when you click it it works it takes you back to your channel and you get more traffic back to your channel where all your videos are as opposed to everybody else's so there you have it guys i hope you enjoy that tutorial uh, i'm going to have a lot more tutorials like that if you actually want to make a request for something that you want to learn how to do uh, just uh, comment below don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe above me all right talk to you later unfortunately you have to be a partner with youtube oh my gosh <laughs>